first matchup had to be happened to be a Pikachu versus his yeah, Roy. Yeah, 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 that's true. And he was mad because Eon had been nine stocking the other teams, and he's like, "Put me in, coach. Put me in." All right, we got battles of furries here. Incineroar actually did receive a couple of buffs. Uh, most notably, I believe, uh, his fair. People said it was like a lot crazier now. Same yeah. with K. Roll fair. So yeah, kind of, kind of the same moves got buffed for both characters. A lot, uh, to, to summarize the buff here for him, the hitbox of fair lasts a little bit longer <laughs> now. Oh, that man was almost robbed of the stage, and he was robbed of the stock. Larry. Okay, you know what? That's he said on, <laughs> oh, sorry, he said on Twitter, <laughs> people need to use I'll be more. It's underrated, and now I know why. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know what? Larry, he tried to cheese the stock, so he got he got robbed off of that. But you know what? That was, high, that was the same risk, same reward. <laughs> exactly. Oh, he was, it looked like he was facing the wrong direction after getting hit by that forward tilt. But he, also, the one thing about Incineroar is that some of his moves don't auto-set the ledge. So for Wolf to have that forward tilt and then those sticking hitbox and forward tilt, down smash, down tilt even, it's really good. Wow, what a return to sender. He says, if I, you're going to send me down there, I will do the favor in kind. Yeah, there we go. That was a great setup, landing fair into the dare. The Ken combo of this game, very fantastic play from Larry. This time redeeming himself, getting himself a juicy dare to be able to start off this next stock. Lunk felt really good about that KO, man, and I feel like he's lost in the sauce from that one, and unfortunately Larry will take advantage of it. 85% to Lunk's name. What can he get? He's down the whole stock, with started off with a great start for him. All right, let's see how... Oh, okay, try to mix it up with how he approaches with that side B. Not yeah. quite going to get anything. Tech chase situation into a down smash. Not quite. He got able to get the tech. Doesn't get the timing right. Good back air. That was good. Using up up smash, it does come up from below, and it does have uh, the one thing Incineroar does also have is intangibility on his arms and his hands whenever he goes for attacks. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see how he gets in. That was, a good, that was a good call out. <laughs> Yo, man, some of these players just have to stop jumping from disadvantage. That is the, that hey is the man, story hey of man, today. That's just, that's just one of those you're scared type of things where I'm I'm you, you see them charging something at the ledge. It's like, okay, I'll jump to get away from it. Oh, wait, <laughs> never mind. It was up smash, not down smash. And then you're like, oh, damn, I've been had. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And jumping out of the corner in any fighting game is never the never the call, dude. I've seen it happen in Street Fighter. I've seen it happen in Mortal Kombat. Heaven forbid you do it in fighters. Like, oh, man. <laughs> You're gonna get called on Larry said, you know what man, the first stock looked good, but the whole game, not so fresh. Hey man, at least Lunk took the stock off Larry. He was he was able he took the most stylish stock off of him. <laughs> where Larry was trying to ruin his life on the first stock, get in his head. He said, nah man, you're the one getting dared. Yeah, that's true. So Lunk, prop, Lunk. props to Lunk. <laughs> Lunk sounds like he might be one of those players that goes to like two open it was close games though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if that's the situation, you know, alright, well let's see here. It's man. like, hey, I took a stock. Right? <laughs> That's, that's, the, that's the thing about a low tier, man. They always just want to take that stock here. But we'll see what Lunk can do here. Game two, Larry looking to just send him right back down. Yeah, he was trying to do it again. Didn't quite position himself correctly. Didn't read the DI, but there we go. Got himself another opportunity. Trying to catch Lunk holding in, I think, but not quite happening. I like what Lunk's doing too, is that he's trying to use the Battlefield platforms to his advantage. It looks like Incineroar's aerials like land perfectly either on the platform when they're trying to come in, yes. or just to cover underneath it with like a falling up air or something. So Lunk's doing a great job on this stage so far. Well, he gets hit by Wolverine's Berserker Claw. Very uh, reminiscent of Wolverine from Marvel vs. Capcom 2. All right, there we go. Another Darkest oh, Lariat. Oh, that was a good... No, that was that would have been a great to go for the clothesline, but unfortunately he didn't go for him. Yeah, either that or he just pressed it a little bit too early. Mm -hmm. the, it is a four-frame input, so sometimes if you're a little nervous, you think preemptively you might miss it and go a little bit early. But there we go, just a up air, just chase him on the landing. Very nice stuff. Nice. Goes for the spot dodge into the down tilt. But one thing that Cinema does have in this game, very missing of Smash 4. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> okay, okay, I mean... Okay, Larry. That, um, that was a homie stock. Yeah, he was like, "Okay, you know what? I saw that you could, like kind of di'd outward and just, like yeah. gave up the stock, so I'll just uh, I'll just give it to you." See, the thing here is in the air to air. That's where Larry's winning. A lot of Wolf's aerials have really good frame data to have that good speed to contest Incineroar, and Incineroar he lacks that great aerial height and the jump that he has and that speed. So that pretty much plays into Wolf's hand. The car scratcher down smash that sends him off the stage and the Berserker Claw to finish him off. <laughs> Lung does not look too happy about that. He doesn't look that. happy at all, man. He's like, he's like, damn, this man, Larry Lur, whoever he is out there, just side beat me off the stage and why prevented me to like coming that? back. Why, why is Larry that why, mean? Why is Larry acting like that, Larry, man? Yeah, he's just a kid. This he probably be, has a family.